A picture taken of a man dressed as a Nazi soldier and his son as Adolf Hitler has drawn disapproval from some of the tri-state. Meanwhile, the man at the center of all this speaks out on his reasoning and regret now. He's exclusively to Eyewitness News. In tonight's top story, Eyewitness News Mike Pickett with the story from the Owensboro Newsroom. Among the many costumes and masks at last night's Trail of Treats in Owensboro, one costume had some people offended. It does disturb because we don't need that. It's a lot of people who've been in concentration camps. Bryant Goldbach dressed as a generic Nazi soldier while his son was dressed as Adolf Hitler. Goldbach says he wanted to do it for historical reasons. We are only in this for living history. He said he came up with the idea at the last minute but started regretting his decision once others at Trailer Treats confronted him. It happened about the time we had the first person approach us. I mean, is that time that clued me in that, okay, maybe we should, shouldn't have did this. It just promoted something that was that terrible, that, that was terrible that happened in the past that uh, definitely maybe shouldn't have been brought up. He could have made his face up. He could have went as, uh, I know clowns, a lot of people are afraid of clowns. And uh, he could have been anything. Not everybody has the devotion to living history that I have. It's, I don't know how else to put it. It's just that I'm sorry that I've, I feel like I've hurt a lot of people. And, uh, you know, I'd give anything to make it right. One downtown business owner tells us they felt dismayed when they saw the photo, adding that they would not have let that person into their business if he was still wearing the costume. In Owensboro, my pick at Eyewitness News. Now, Eyewitness News reached out to Rabbi Gary Mazo from Temple Adath B'nai Israel in Evansville about the photo. Rabbi Mazo says the fact that the father apologized is important. The fact that he did not know the costumes would be offensive is a very sad reflection on our society. The rabbi goes on to say a good rule of thumb would be if your costume calls to mind an event where millions were killed, choose another costume. You can read Rabbi Mazel's full statement on our website, tristatehomepage.com.